Hello and welcome to my blog. I am Devon and you're watching my show, Small Mouth Big Lion. The reason for my absolute madness this morning is because I actually started for my first time ever attending TV presenter school. I know it's kind of weird. But I attended another lesson, it was quite a lot of fun. I actually took a lot of footage before and during my initial interview process. cool a little bit nerve-wracking you know it's like you get the butterflies in your stomach because you've got to talk to a camera and there's people around you and phew, it gets a little bit intense but you know for the most part it was it was quite cool I did pretty well I guess for my first time you have to write your own script and all that I don't ever write a script so that's why it was kind of nerve-wracking then you have to learn your script and learn your words I prefer just ad-libbing and making a fool of myself seems to make more sense to me anyway <laughs> Anyways, what, what, what I did find quite interesting is they don't teach you to be a presenter like you see on normal TV, you know. And now at 8 o'clock we'll be joined by the news, followed by an excellent episode of Two and a Half Men. Nothing like that at all, which is, which is quite cool. They, they like to keep people's personalities intact. They want you to be your own persona on a, as a presenter for a show or whatever. You need to bring a little bit more of yourself out, which, which I can relate to because you know, there's a lot of myself to give. <laughs> I'm in a good mood. Anyways, uh, so yeah, it was quite cool. Apparently I look really good in camera, so that's cool. And I have a good energy, which is cool. Um, apparently when I was on camera, I didn't use my mouth wide enough. I was talking like this, and it was, it was wrong. I must must expand my mouth and make it wider so that people can see what I'm saying and that sort of stuff. So it was pretty cool. <laughs> uh, so I've got to do a lot more of that and I'm looking forward to it. So it's every Saturday. So a lot of my Saturdays get taken up, which is not a bad thing, you know. Uh, it's, it's quite fun at the same time because it's very practical. You know, I'm always behind the camera, learning new things, techniques, all that sort of stuff. So it's been fun for the, for the first few or first lesson at least. So we'll see how that goes and where it takes us. It's given me a couple of new ideas, so hoping those will come to fruition. Fruition? Fruition? You know what I mean. So, yeah. <clears throat> besides that, it's back to the normal week work. Can you believe? Holy crap, I couldn't believe it. It's like next week is Diablo 3. Diablo 3 is launching next, sorry, I'm gonna do the whole mouth thing a lot. I gotta practice. So Diablo 3 is out next week. I am so excited. I'm so excited. It's gonna be a lot of fun, and so is Max Payne. <laughs> now, this is, now this is where the conflict comes in. Max Payne or Diablo 3? I don't know, I really, really don't know, because I, I think I can love both games equally. Uh, and I will probably play a lot more of Diablo 3 but then I'll probably dedicate a lot of my weekend to Max Payne. I don't know. Let's see. I'm also going to be really busy this weekend. Like I say, I've got school, I've got a birthday and then I'm going to go paintballing. So, lots to do. Busy again. There goes my weekend. Oh well, please excuse the hair. It's a bad hair day. Very bad hair day. I know, it's all good. Just try not to look, try not to look. Okay, well, I'm not gonna keep you for too long. I think I've uh, taken enough of your time. Uh, I have done quite a few vids, so I'm quite happy with those. Did you check my, my Dirt Showdown vid? Oh, I'm so excited. The promo video is almost ready. That's gonna be cool, I'm excited. And apparently, Monster 
Monster UK have caught wind of our whole promotion and they are, they are excited. They're, we're excited, yes. Sure we, been fun. Okay, I'm gonna leave you now. Ciao.